Jack loves playing in the attic. Jack loves playing in the attic. Lots of magical things happen there. He had a closet full of stuff and a soldier there named Ben that came alive. Then he played with Ben some days. He was our doctor. He took care of Ben with a stethoscope, a sling, and little glass bottles full of a terrible tasting medicine. One day he found a felt head with a feather. He found he put it on and poop. He was loving hood and Ben was little John. Another day he found the funny love power as soon as he wrapped it around his shoulders when suddenly he was Superman with flying powers. Today Doug and Ben were looking for a new adventure they dug deep into the the of uh, the closet. Suddenly, Jack heard out a magnifying glass, and bam! Jack was Sherlock Holmes, and Ben was Doctor Watson. They began in this. Jetting, uh, the attic hours later they found some <clears throat> they found something interesting in the darkest corner under a chair there was a tiny scrap of paper Jack tried to read it but he writing was too small he Put it under the uh, magnifying <clears throat> glass. It was a treasure map. Bingo! He heard. All of a sudden, they were surrounded by pirates. They, the pirates talked with Jack and he dropped it. His magic being glass, he looked back and the uh, parrot cur carried them up to their ship. Ben had tur turned back into a door and he sat beside the magic glass on the floor. In the ship, the pirate opened the map and tried to lead the introduction. It was impossible. The words were too small. They wanted Jack to tell them what it said, but he couldn't. He couldn't lead it without his magic magnifying glass. The pirate Threatened to draw him out, <clears throat> out the ship. It is didn't help if he didn't help. Jack didn't know what to do. The pirates put him on a plank. They made him start working toward the water. Suddenly, a ship appeared. It was Ben in a boat full of soldiers. The, the, the soldiers attacked the pirates and lead Jack. The pirates lead only treated and sailed away. Ben had brought along the magic thing glass. They took a close look at the treasure map. The map showed them and way to a secret island. Soon they found the 
straight to the treasure after uh, hours and hours of uh, searching they discovered a cave inside the cave was a big or chest Jack reached to open open the lid suddenly they heard loud footstep the pirates are back and shouted the door cracked open and it was Jack's mom it's snack time she said to Jack, I did I interrupt anything? No, I was just playing. Jack said, I'll calm down in just a second. He looked at Ben and Ben looked very disappointed. Don't worry, Ben. Uh, we'll find the treasure tomorrow. Jack carved up the magic if wing glass and a tiny scrap of paper see i still have this what should you do now i still want to see a movie i don't i'd little late i'll come if anyone goes uh same here good which movie do you want to see dinosaur park um, not bad. The theater is from from here. Let's take a bus. Who needs a bus? Everybody, keep our fingers closed. Yes, we'll need a lot of lucky to do this. I want to see dinosaurs. I want to see dinosaurs. I want to see dinosaurs. Uh, it worked. It really worked. What did you do? Uh, you should have asked first. You're just hopeless. I want to see dinosaur lear dinosaurs. Well, well, it's too late anyway. I can't believe this. I must be dreaming. I wish you were dreaming, Junsu. Why do you say that? Look at that volcano. It is going to erupt. Run. Yuri, keep running. Hurry. I can't run anymore. This is all your fault. Well, I didn't make the volcano erupt. No, but you brought us here. There aren't any volcanoes at a movie theater. Come on, we don't have much time. You're right, quick, you know. Wish us out of here. We want to go home. We want to go home. Watch out. Here comes the lava. Everybody stop. We have to hurt the book. No. Uh, don't run, don't stop, run, why? There are dinosaurs behind us, real dinosaurs. How scary, I think we're safe up here. Be careful, the dinosaurs can still reach us. Everybody heard the book. This trip is exciting. Are you crazy? We want to go home. You always get uh, into trouble nayang we want to go home you act without thinking we want to go home see we are back everything is okay isn't it hold on where are yuri where are yuri and junsu oh no there's me they're missing oh no look uh come back with us hey jun what are you doing Aren't you going to school? What's wrong with the computer? I can't log in. Mom changed the password to stop us playing games. What? How could she? Uh, what do I leave for now? June, have some breakfast before you go. I'm not hungry. 
I'm feeling out of touch with Suji, and everyone hates me at home. What's the big deal about Grace anyway? Kim Joo, what are you doing here or alone? Look who's here, Hip Hop Hong Hana and Tor Tower Hayumi. I didn't know the King of Games enjoyed peace and quiet. Don't even start. I think I'm going crazy. Check this out. Dancing is the cure, cure for anything. I'm not in the mood. Eating always makes you feel better when you're feeling now. Eating again, you just have breakfast. Eating makes you happy. I don't have an appetite. You change your mind once you get there. Where are we going? A paradise for us hungry folks. Three hamburgers and uh, three cocks, please. Can you make it quick? We're in a hurry. I don't have any money on me. Don't worry, it's my treat. Wow, you're rich. How present give her a large allowance because she was such a big appetite. You really do have an appetite. Hannah said you just bre ate breakfast. Don't look at me so strangely. You'd get hungry too after a good tra training season. Uh, they're playing training middle. Session. Uh, ah, season Training session. They are playing middle meters. Could next month so they are doing much training right now really middle has a pretty good basketball team no problem as long as tower tower is here middle is a piece of cake yeah you're right i'll be chain uh, cheering for you Hurry up, Edith. You look like you have eaten for days. I was so upset that I didn't have breakfast this morning. What's up? My mom has for my mom has forbidden me to play computer games because of my bad grades. Hey, you're not the, uh, the only one. Mine too. I guess we're both in the same but hey let's not ruin our appetites now eating really does leave me a relieve stress